Okay, so before we start cooking, you want to make sure you have everything cut. We have the mushroom cut right here, and then we have the bell pepper, and the fish cake, and we have the onion, uh, the strained spinach, and then we have the green onion, which is cut in about two inches wide, and you want to make sure that you cut it big, uh, not into small pieces. And then we have the shredded carrot. And then you have to use like this weight. Yeah, so you want to shred it not with um, a knife, but you want to shred it with um, this tool. Okay. Okay, so right now we're going to put the spinach into the boiling water. And this is only going to take about a minute, so we'll leave it in there for a minute and then um, we'll have that prepared. Okay, so right now what we do is we're going to prepare the spinach. We're going to take the spinach and take a little bit of sesame oil, pour that in here, and a little bit of salt, like a pinch of salt. And then we're just going to mix that with our clean hands. Mix that in, mix that in really good because you want the spinach to have a certain type of flavor when it goes into the noodle. And also, in the yam noodles, you want to make sure that you cut that into um, into shorter bits um, because you don't want the noodles to be too long. And um, because you put that out of the water so long, you want to take a little bit of the same sesame oil and put that in there. Mix it around because you don't want it to be out too long from the water and get all sticky. Right. Hi, and this is a Korean yam noodle. And first, you have to put it into the hot boiling water right there. And then, after about five minutes, we're gonna um, pull into the cold water. Okay, so what we're gonna do right now, Inha is going to take the mushrooms, mushrooms. and we're gonna put it into olive oil and we're gonna take a little bit of salt just like about a pinch of salt and put that on top of there and stir it around and keep that cooking for a little bit until you can hear a little bit sizzling in there very good and usually what we have to do is cook each of these vegetables separately you don't want to mix these in um, so we're going to first cook the mushroom and then usually we have to cook with the meat but since I'm a vegetarian and some people might don't like the fish or I mean, the meat then we, I mean that's why we don't really use the meat here so Right, so for this dish we're going to use mushroom only Okay, as you can see the mushroom is coming along pretty well and now we're going to go ahead and cook the green onion and yellow onion together Exactly, so here's Inha Pouring in the green onion and the yellow onion, and we're gonna mix that around in the olive oil and keep that cooking for a little bit. Okay. And this is extra for five people, so I don't think it's too much. Mm -hmm. Have the 
few soy sauce first about this much, I guess. And then red pepper. Actually, it's like a black pepper. About this much. And then sugar, so it doesn't taste too salty. Yeah, I think it's okay. Oh, wait a minute. We have to tell something about. Okay, since we have mom and we live with the family, we don't really cook by ourselves. So this is the first time we cook for a Korean dishes. So I hope you guys understand. And then we stick together. Make sure you put the sauce in so that you're putting color in here. Okay? And then after we do that, inhale, why don't we bring some of the spinach that we made and put that in here. The onion and the green onion in there. Everything that we just cooked separately, and especially the mushroom. Okay, let's put that down. Okay, and let me mix them together. And we're just gonna mix that in there. And usually, you know, a lot of people use the spoon, but in Korean style, it's best to use your clean hands because you can mix that flavors all in together. Right. that we just prepared, just mixed up, and it looks really good. So we're gonna um, take this and put it into the bowl separately. So Ina, do you wanna serve us? Yes. Okay. Hi, oh, long. It is really long. Make sure you cut it so it's not too long, so it's easy to eat. Okay, and then we'll serve the class too. Actually, from my professor. Okay, there you go. And here's some chopsticks. Okay. Oh, hi, Benny. And here's Benny. I guess he wants to join too. <laughs> okay, so enjoy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for helping. You're welcome. Anytime. All right, bye. bye. This is my oh. brother, Alan. And? Oh, you're this? taping this too? Yeah. <laughs> you want to try some? Yeah, I mean, oh, I'm hungry after that work all day. Yeah, I hope you like it. Mm -hmm. I'll be the judge of that. Yeah, let us know if it's better than the restaurant. You can always go to Conquer Korean Market. This is where we got all of the vegetables. Honestly, mm -hmm. it the fresher the ingredients and the vegetables, mm -hmm. the better. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye.